China implemented the new mechanism on the first day of trading for 2016, but the system designed to prevent large swings in the market instead caused panic when it halted trading automatically on the first day as soon as stocks fell by 7%. Across the globe, investors waited anxiously to see what would transpire. China's first day of trading triggered a global sell-off and saw India's biggest single-day percentage fall in over four months. Primarily, uh, there is an issue with the Chinese economy and overall uh, emerging market question. Uh, there is a question mark over emerging market performance. So that is the single most reason, I mean, not single most, but one of the main reasons for uh, markets to go down. The shock was felt on Wall Street as well as the Dow Jones plummeted by more than 2%. It looks like the Chinese monetary authorities are trying to, I mean, they're wading into the, the markets and intervening more than people in the U.S. would. And it, it sounds like they're trying to stabilize the market, you know, make it a safer place. So they put in uh, various measures that didn't work overnight and it fell 7% and the market was closed. So if that market closes, people start selling in other markets. But uh, yeah, manufacturing's key right now. And uh, it, the amazing thing to me is both our uh, purchasing manager survey and the China one are at the same level. I think they're both 48.2, aren't they? Oil prices and stocks fell as well on the Thursday as the mechanism halted trading once again. The Chinese authorities then scrapped the mechanism, a move that allowed markets internationally to recover as China's stocks opened higher the day after. Despite global markets recovering quickly, the move has now led to Chinese investors calling for greater transparency and more market liquidity.